26.31, a very warm welcome back everybody. Let's take a look back at what's making news headlines this morning. South Africa has recorded 104 more COVID-19 related deaths. And this takes the total number of fatalities to 50,566. The total number of confirmed COVID-19 cases is 1,518,979. Recovery stand at 1,437,050. And the total number of vaccines administered so far is 100. 1,180. Health Minister Tutazwelim Kiza says while the country is still mourning those who lost their battle to the COVID-19 pandemic, the country has come a long way and embraced a fighting spirit. He has thanked all the South Africans for their cooperation during the health crisis. Mkiza was speaking at Gray's Hospital in Piramarisburg a year after the, phase, the first confirmed case was reported at the same healthcare institution. He has appealed to South Africans to wait patiently for their turn to be vaccinated. And the South African Zionist Federation says it believes the decision of the Judicial Conduct Committee against Chief Justice Mokheng Mokheng must be taken on review. In its 67-page decision, the JCC has ordered that the Chief Justice apologize unconditionally and retract statements relating to South Africa's stance on Israel. He made those comments during a webinar hosted by the Jerusalem Post in June last year. The local chapter of the Boycott, Diverse Sanctions Movement, together with two other organizations, had launched a complaint to the JCC.